I, to the last day, never got used to the fact that these people (laughs) who were the only people who were the only people we wanted for these roles agreed to do it. And then I'd watch on my monitor and I would see them saying these things that I wrote. I could not believe it. It blew me away. Fleischman is your debut novel. It came out just a few years ago. So, I mean, what is it like to see it on screen already? Like, is it like a surreal pinch me moment? It's not even pinch me. It's that I can't even process it. Like, it feels like the movie version of somebody's life that I'm walking around Manhattan with cabs and billboards and people texting me. I almost got hit by a Fleischman cab yesterday, (laughs) which was a great New York moment for me. So (laughs) so, yeah, it's it's wild. Awesome. And, you know, I think, you know, they say writing is never done, you know, a work is never done. So when you're revisiting Fleischman to adapt it, because you wrote seven out of eight episodes, did you find yourself like correcting things or in your head, you were like, what was that process like for you? I've worked in magazines and at a newspaper, and I have gotten very, very good at knowing when it's over, knowing when you cannot make corrections. The only problem is that usually that's when I stop reading it, this, (laughs) then I had to keep watching it for VFX and for sound, and I learned a lot of discipline. Um, And luckily, there are a lot of things that you can change around, but it wasn't so easy for me. When you're doing that, did you find the process was different than when you're writing for the magazine or you're writing for the novel? Like, how did you kind of approach doing scripts differently than you would have maybe um, in like the other work that you've done? In the other work that I've done, I always have to think of the relevance and the news angle and why it's important for the reader to know. And I, someone kept saying to me, Susanna Grant and Sarah Timberman, my my executive producing partners kept saying to me, whatever isn't essential, don't you don't include it. And I was like, I worked at a newspaper. None of this is essential. Like <laughs> nobody needs to know any of it. Um, and that was a hard metric for me to learn. Um, but I had the book as this guiding light and it made it made it easier for me to think, what would somebody who enjoyed this book want to see now? That was a great question to ask throughout. And I mean, I do feel like some of it, a lot of it it is essential, you know, like the dating app stuff and, you know, the divorce stuff. I mean, the divorce rate is sky high in America these days. So, I mean, you were kind of tapping into that and and holding on to that in a way. That's a good point. But first of all, the divorce rate has always been sky high these days, like all the days. Yeah. (laughs) And people have always been dating in a new way, even if this is our newest way. But I agree with you that that it it did it it spoke to the moment, but it also existed, right? Like the adaptation can keep you very calm because all you have to do is adapt it. You don't have to make it new. You don't have to make it newly relevant. You know, you've got such a great cast on this project as well. So was there anything oh like you were particularly excited to see brought to life or a, a character or a moment that like when you saw it on camera, you were just like, oh my gosh. I have to tell you, even the smallest moments, I can't think of one of the big moments. I, to the last day, never got used to the fact that these people <laughs> who were the only people who were the only people we wanted for these roles agreed to do it. And then I'd watch on my monitor and I would see them saying these things that I wrote. I could not believe it. It blew me away all the way to the end. It wasn't about a moment. It was about the existence of it. Well, I loved it. I loved the show so I'm much. I'm so glad. Thank you. Yeah your time today. It was such a pleasure speaking with you. It's such a pleasure. Thank you for your great questions. Thank you.